Russia hacking the US elections in 60. Ready? Let's ride. All we keep hearing about from the mainstream media is how Russia hacked the US elections. However, that is a false narrative. The source mainstream media keeps citing is a confidential person within the security community. The other document cited, a joint investigation from the FBI and DHS, has a huge disclaimer on top saying they don't stand behind what's in the document. The simple fact is that every single developed nation is constantly hacking each other because in this day and age, knowledge is power. In fact, we were caught red-handed hacking Germany and trying to influence the Israeli elections. Not to mention all of the regimes we've toppled only to have a worse one pop up because of our supposed intelligence. The sad fact is that John Podesta fell for a phishing scheme when he got a suspicious email from someone claiming to be Google. He entered his password. From there, his emails were leaked. He might as well have sent all of his money to a Nigerian prince. More important, though, is the fact that they've never disputed the validity of the emails. We should be thanking whoever leaked them for showing us how much disdain and corruption is in the DNC. To this day, WikiLeaks has been 100% accurate and Julian Assange has the credibility that mainstream media lost during this last election. He says he didn't get the emails from Russia and he hasn't lied to us yet. Links to today's stories are in the description and for more news in 60 seconds, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel.